do you ever have a, a limb that you need to lift um, you know lift it away from a hazard provide clearance doing a tip tie um, a real quick two to one mechanical advantage limb lift that I like to use or like to do is this pinto pulley ultra sling right here that I made it's got this sweet diamond knot or button knot on the end um, this button knot can be used to go around a limb or the main stem of a tree like this and you can have your rope installed that way your rope can always stay installed and you can remove it from the tree by using the button knot versus actually girth hitching it or going around a limb like that with the pulley where you can't leave your rope installed um, or I should say you have to remove the rope in order to pull the pulley out of the sling. Um, I'm going to make a video, a splicing video, on how to make one of these for you guys here soon. So be sure to keep an eye out for that if this little doohickey ultra sling interests you. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and do a limb lift on this limb down here. And I have a large substantial lead above me. So I'm going to go ahead and pass my pinto around the lead. Go ahead and put it, just put it in the pocket there. Choke it down and take my rigging line I'm going to borrow a carabiner maybe not let's see what I got oh yeah I got a carabiner I always climb with the secondary hitch climber system with me you never know when you're going to need it so take my rigging line here, this is half inch. Um, I think it's the millimeters, or yeah, half inch. Um, Teppelberger Sirius. Go through our pulley here. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna attach a carabiner, terminate it on, pull a, put a little slip knot in here so I'm not stuck holding the weight of the rope and risk losing the rigging line. I'm just going to tie an anchor hitch on this. By the way, if you guys haven't tried out these new Arb Session gloves here, uh, for their price point, I don't think that they can beat. They are um, extremely grippy and they've lasted quite some time. So, uh, big win there. Thanks, Casey. Anyway. So we're going to go ahead and take this carabiner now and terminate it to the rated becket of the pentapole. So follow along with me here. Uh, we have the lowering side or the, the fall of the rigging line that's going to go down towards the ground crew and where they can use um, like a, you know, a lowering device, um, GRCS, bollard or quarter wrap in order to control the um, descent of the piece we're about to cut but as you can see we have a whip right here or a two to one mechanical advantage so this is extremely effective if you have to do a limb lift for overhang so I'm gonna go ahead and just take this bite of rope with me clip it in my harness here and I'm gonna go ahead and descend down onto this limb that I'm going to do the limb lift with so let's get down there and get to work some rope here to work with make sure my rigging line and my climbing line are in different rope lanes here so we're going to get out here and do a little limb walk keeping my weight in my saddle okay so I'm out here and I'm towards you know I'm well past the balance point of the limb um, I'm out here on the outer third of the limb getting a good work position trim up this little dead branch right here All right, now 
to make this quick and easy, I'm going to go ahead and take a speed line sling and go around the limb. Carabiner. Now, that bite, myself up a little bit. So I have a pinto pulley here. I'm gonna go ahead and remove this from my harness, the rigging line. I'm gonna capture this bite with a pinto pulley. Now you don't have to use a pinto pulley. It's just gonna give us more mechanical advantage by reducing friction. So now that's connected out here on the branch tip. I'm gonna go back towards our rigging line so you can see what kind of mechanical advantage we have. So back towards the main stem of the tree and we can see our two parts of line going out towards the branch tip. I'm going to go ahead and pull on the lowering side so you can see that we have a substantial amount of mechanical advantage to lift this limb. So again, for overhang, if we have to lift the tip away from a hazard, very, very effective, very quick. Um, <clears throat> all the ground crew's got to do is undo the pencil pulley and then get sent right back up to you and you can run this around the tree and do the next one, do the next one, do the next one if you need to. Um, also, if you're worried about the, the butt swinging out, um, you know, because again, we're going to do a, a limb lift, so we're probably going to do a cut on top, an open face cut, lift this limb up, cut it free, the butt's going to want to swing out. So if that's a, a cause for concern, we can butt hitch it. So take a piece of rope and, you know, go underneath your face cut and back cut and butt hitch it, allow it to settle, untie that butt hitch, or you can install another lowering line, um, tag line, the rigging thimble, pulley right there towards the butt at your cut point. That way you can restrict it, uh, the butt from swinging out. So very effective uh, mechanical advantage in the tree for limb lift.